This is Earth four billion years ago. There was no oxygen in the air. Molten lava flowed into an already poisonous sea. Hard to imagine, but this harsh environment was perfect for nurturing a miracle. Rain washed the necessary chemicals from the air, and lightning and ultraviolet radiation cooked these chemicals into an organic soup. And somehow, when the smoke cleared, there was something new, something amazing. A very, very special molecule with a graceful spiral shape. And it had talent. It could make copies of itself faster than it could be destroyed. This was the origin of life on Earth. multicellular animals that had specialized cells were sponges. Six hundred million years ago, an ancient worm was the first animal to develop a centralized nervous system. In fact, this was the first animal with a head. And light-sensitive cells in that head were the world's first eyes. Then, all of a sudden, a huge variety of creatures appeared. This event is called the Cambrian Explosion. Every animal group alive today had its origin in the Cambrian. The first fish appeared more than 500 million years ago, a predecessor to mankind's own group, the chordates. Four hundred million years ago, much of the earth was already covered in green. Plants had colonized fresh waters and spread onto land.
fins became more and more like legs. The vertebrates were on the verge of a breakthrough. Reptiles evolved from amphibians, but with tougher waterproof skins, they were able to occupy entirely new habitats. Reptiles also pioneered another breakthrough, waterproof eggs. Ancient relatives of the crocodile, though, found a solution. By standing up on their legs, these reptiles began to walk tall and breathe easier. Hard to imagine, hard to imagine, hard to imagine. But this harsh environment was perfect for nurturing a miracle. A miracle. A miracle. A miracle. 